What is the current state of the art in the management of anemia in cirrhotic hepatitis C patients? I think there's a few things to remember with patients who have cirrhosis who are getting hepatitis C treatment, and particularly for genotype 1 patients. So patients with cirrhosis may have low hemoglobins and just some baseline anemia anyway. And so they need a, a pre-treatment evaluation. Are they iron deficient? Is there anything that can be done to improve their hemoglobin before we start treatment? The other thing to remember is that there's likely to be a significant drop in their hemoglobin, especially if they get a first-generation protease inhibitor like bosiprevir or telaprevir. You have to plan for a four to six gram drop in hemoglobin. So that means you need to watch patients closely. I, I check on patients with their labs weekly for the first few weeks until we're sure things are stable. Then when they do go below 10 grams per deciliter, then the issue is do you go with dose reduction of ribavirin or do you go with erythropoietin type agents? Uh, and that's been well studied that actually both strategies are quite effective. Both strategies lead to similar response rates and cure. Uh, so my personal recommendation, and, and that's supported by many others at this point, is that you initially go with the ribavirin dose reduction. The key is though to not just slowly inch it down, but to come all the way down to 600 milligrams right away. Make sure you've got that anemia under control, uh, and then hopefully you can proceed on at that dose. If that dose is not, if that reduction in the dose is not effective, at that point you might need to consider erythropoietin being added in uh, to the regimen. If the ribavirin dose reduction alone works uh, and the patient's hemoglobin even improves, you might actually be able to inch up on the dose of ribavirin. Uh, but those are sort of the general approaches. I think the key to whatever your strategy is, is to help maintain the patient on a reasonable dose of the ribavirin so that they can stay on the regimen all in all uh, and hopefully get cure of their hep C.